Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is I Dream with Cindy from idreamwithcindy.com. I'm gonna start doing these random check-ins where if I need to get something paid, um, I will make a video, explain the expense, and do this weekly. And maybe it might be every two weeks by weekly. However, um, you know, I decide to schedule everything. So today, I wanted to take out some money from my sinking funds to put back in my account. And I don't wanna do this till the end of the month because my buffer money won't cover it. So I've never seen this done before. So let's see how this goes. So if you wanna see how I keep track of my budgets and move money back to my account, then keep watching. This month, I paid $29 for my website. So that needs to be taken care of by the end of the month would be from my business sales or it would be from another or would be from my direct payment from my source of income gas these are all from my cash envelopes so i won't need to take these out amazon i spent 32.89 in clothing and take 32.89 So I don't have enough. I only have $30. So I still owe myself $2.89. Target for toiletries, that's that was paid on the spot using the money. Um, it's on for $20. So let's go over to gifts. And we're gonna take 20 out of gifts. This, it says husband, that's the category, but we take this out of our um, bank account. So husband in our, in our envelopes is for immigration fees. Today and a few days ago, I was charged for farmers. And this was our home insurance. And this was for $70. So we're gonna go to our home insurance binder and see if we have enough. We only have $20. Yeah, we, we only have $20 in our home insurance, so we're still short. Let's see where we can take uh, $50. I think we're gonna have to take the fifty dollars out of out of our side hustle. Fifty. Okay. And we're left with twenty dollars in side hustle. So farmers has been taken care of. Now we have fifteen dollars. $5.99 so 15 plus 6 is $21 so we're gonna take that out of our Cindy envelope and if we don't have enough we'll pull out of somewhere else so my Cindy envelope has So my Cindy envelope has 10. So we need $11 and I'll take it out of our savings challenge. So we'll take it 10 out of our $5 savings. And then $1 from our savings challenge. Okay, we also have $75 for, so we also have $75 here, 
75 and 10. So 73.99. Let's not even count the cents, but 74 plus 10 is $84. So I don't know if we're going to be able to pull $74 from other envelopes. I don't know. We'll see right now. I'm so sorry if you guys hear background noise. I'm going to try to edit it. Or if there's bad editing, I'm so sorry. I'm doing this in the daytime. So right now, we were able to get 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 10, 20, 30, 141. So right now, we still need $84 to take care of Amazon and Amazon spending and, and Klarna. So let's see where we can take $84 out of. Guys, I don't want to touch my savings challenge. But I think I'm going to have to. $84. Um, I don't know where else I can take it out of, guys. Because everything has a... A purpose, you know. It would have to be either from truck savings or special events. No. So, if we can't find somewhere to take the money out of, I'm just going to have to leave it like that and work a little extra hours to take care of it because like I can't pull in utilities we have I think a hundred but I can't pull this out right because my utilities are due next week so there's no purpose in taking it out and then I'm not going to be able to get it um car insurance is due on the 17th school fund um in two weeks we have to pay seven hundred dollars so I I don't even want to touch it because right now I only have five hundred dollars left toiletries mom and dad yeah so i think i'm just gonna have to work extra hours for this um 84 i can take out of my savings challenge i don't think i have enough though i have 5 10 15 20 25 30 35 what if i would take out of here 49 um Okay, I'm gonna take 15 out of my savings challenge. So $69. Okay, let me take 29. Okay, so we'll go into our ones and take out $9. One, two, three, four, five, six. I still don't have enough. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. We'll do 26. Okay, so let's pull out of our savings challenge. So I'm gonna pull 20 out of my $5 savings. And then we have one, two, three, four, five, six. And we'll pull six out of our $1 savings. So we have 43 left. I'm gonna pull the other 20 out of my side hustle. Okay. So we have 23 and then I'm going to pull and I'm gonna pull 20 out of my husband's envelope. So we're still short $3 and then we'll pull $5 from health. Yeah. So we're positive $2. Okay. Okay, guys. Fast Track. Fast Track has... Um, Fast Track has already a... That's already been taken out of because if you guys remember, I had an envelope for this 
but now it's just directly in my car. Um, car payments, this has been taken care of already. Gas, like I said, everything here has been taken care of. Um, transfer business. Okay, so guys, that is it. The only thing that I didn't take care of was um, my website. be more responsible and on top of it try to promote a little more and take care of it with its purpose money you know so so total to the bank is 20 40 60 80 100 20 40 50 60 70 75 80 85 90 95 100 105 106 7 8 9 10 11 12 hundred and twelve dollars so guys I did I am trying to cut back a lot on spending because when I made that video for you guys the sinking funds update I was so sad you know because everything adds up and you don't really see it when you purchase things you know hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you in my next video. Have a wonderful weekend. God bless you guys. And remember, the decisions you make today will affect how long it takes for you to reach your dreams tomorrow.